Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Wandering Gypsy Deb. If you would hit that subscribe button, notification bell, give this video a like and share it with your friends and family because sharing is caring. So who doesn't like a van tour? Well here today we're going to take a tour of my 2018 Dodge Grand Caravan SE. Her name is Scarlett Ovana. So come on inside and let's see what's in there. Okay, we're going to start out here, and we have our Joy Titus refrigerator. It's a 12-volt, 26-quart, and it holds quite a bit of stuff in there. I can usually camp for three or four days and have enough room for all my food in there to keep it cold. It runs off my Jackery. 500 watt power supply which I have down here and it's also plugged into my 12 volt outlet on the van that only runs when the car is running this way I get to charge it up while I'm driving back behind my bed I keep some extra paper towels and toilet paper And here is my bed. It's 24 inches wide by 75 inches long. I have a 4 inch thick trifold memory foam mattress under here that's pretty comfortable to sleep on. And I use cot sheets on top of it. And along with a quilt. And I also have some blankets down there for when it gets cold. It's on a metal bed frame. Which is very strong. It's 14 inches tall. So there's plenty of storage underneath as you can see. And we have some bins under here. Which I'll show you. Remove these bungee cords. Put them in backwards, unfortunately. Okay. So, in this one is all my tech gadgets, charging cords, things like that. I have a Coleman lantern here. Battery charger for my camera batteries. A LED light for photography. My Hot Logic Mini, so if I want to heat up something, I can plug this into my Jackery and heat my food up. It usually takes about two hours to heat up a frozen dinner. So that's what we have in the tech box. Let's put this back under there. And then here is our clean box with all our cleaning things, which we have Lysol wipes, we have bath wipes, we have more bath wipes, shower wipes, we have face wipes, dude wipes, we have some Dr. Bronner soap in here, some baby wipes, some Toilet bags and flip flops just in case I go to a campground and there's a shower so I don't have to have my feet on the germy floor. Okay. Under here is my one burner butane stove. And then we have a toolbox, which we have. Some steel tent stakes, rubber mallet in case we put a tent up, dustpan, miscellaneous bungee cords and tools, pliers, scissors, and that's about it. 
And back here is my fancy smancy toilet cover, which under here is my Reliance Hassock toilet, which I absolutely love. I've had it for a couple years now and I use it all the time on road trips. Over here we have a pack gear, it's actually a suitcase organizer, but I put all my clothes in it. It has these zipper things. You can put clothes in each compartment. Shirts, pants. Under here is a attachable laundry hamper. Here I hang my hats on this hook, a command hook. And this is a rechargeable light. Pretty bright, it has two settings on it. Actually three, an emergency setting. Over here I have these slim carts that I actually crammed on top of the armrests. And I have them held in by these bungee cords. So up here I have my pine cat litter, which I use in my toilet for deodorizing purposes. A rechargeable fan. Uh, some wipes, toilet wipes. Some plants. Some nice lavender spray. Uh touch light which you're not going to see because it's too bright in here and when i'm boondocking i have a fold-up table here and this is my 100 watt solar panel from jackery plugs into the jackery and keeps it charged up free with the sun on the other side of the van i have another one of the same shelves with another fan a thermometer. Down here I keep a charging cable for my phone with a power bank. And here is my remote control for my fairy lights which are all along the ceiling. I'll turn them on. Maybe you can see them a little bit Get up close. So they have different colors. They look a lot better in the night, nighttime. Okay, and I have that held on the side here with some Velcro so I don't lose it. Definitely don't want to lose our remote controls. And there's another fan. And one more here. And these have nice clips on them. I mean, really strong clips. And they also have a remote control that you can use with a light if you need to use one. Uh, on the back here I have my privacy curtain which is held on by magnets, earth magnets along this pipe strapping which I have covered up with some seam binding held up by these binder clips here. Actually they have little pins, they're push pins for bulletin boards. So this is the way you can see. Goes up like that. And let's go around to the back and see what's back there. Okay, so in the back I have a cheap Dollar Tree organizer here with my butane for my stove. I have this bottle, which actually you can fill with water, has a nozzle here, and you can spray water out of it, which I use to wash my hair. Uh, some cooking spray, fire extinguisher, which you should always have one, germ wipes, some trash bags. This is a rechargeable faucet which goes on the top of this water jug here to dispense water, which is nice. Back here we have my window coverings from WeatherTech. 
which fit like a glove on my windows. There's a silver side and a black side, so you can reverse them. So in the winter, if you want to have the black side out, it'll draw the heat in and warm your car. In the summer, put the silver side out to reflect the sun to keep your car cool. The only thing, the back window on this Dodge Grand Caravan is kind of unique in its shape, so the WeatherTech cover only goes one way with the silver side out, but that's okay. So back here I keep my camera equipment. And under the bed, see my tripods, a 12 volt vacuum cleaner, uh, another table, which is a roll top table, which I'll be getting out later and showing you in another video when I do a cooking demonstration, hiking stick snake chaps because I'm out in the desert a lot and there are rattlesnakes and that's about it let's go around to this side and my extra paper products well uh, there's a bin right here with food in it and I keep bungeed in cups, my windshield cover, and my fold-up chair. This is the uh, cooking and table bin, which has all the things in it that I need to cook. So let's take a look inside. So in here we have a collapsible sink which has a drain on it. Let's see if I can open this up with one hand to show you. Nice and deep too. And we have a tablecloth and some clips for whenever we're actually somewhere that has a picnic table. Uh, some foil. We have a windshield, wind shield, that goes around the butane stove for when it's windy out. Paper products, frying pan, coffee cup, another pot. Another coffee cup, a dish towel, and some odds and ends utensils, a collapsible tea kettle, some spatulas, measuring spoons, a little cutting board. Some more spatulas, can opener, that type of stuff. So. so, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like. Leave me a comment if the, you had any questions on any of the items. I'll put a list and link of all the items I have in the description box below. So check that out in case you're interested. And thanks for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video when I wander again.